Oh, that was weird. Um, Mr. Hoist, what's up with all these pipes? I mean, a person doesn't need this many pipes, right? Perhaps Mario is here. Who the heck is Mario? Is he a plumber? Yes, it is a joke from the 20th century. What's the 20th century? The 20th century. It is a century farther than where we were born. Far what? Shut up. Shut up about what? What, did I insult you or something? You called me ancient technology. When did I do that? I never called you ancient technology. I just asked about plumbers. What do they do? They do the jobs robots do now. Oh, that's silly. <gasps> oh, pressing the big button made the thingy go up. Ooh, I want to do it again. Oh my gosh, that's so cool, Mr. Voice. Don't you agree? Yes, it is fascinating. I can't believe after all these years of technology, we can make buttons that move doors. Yeah, I know, it's so cool, right? I'm pressing the button as hard as I can. Oh my gosh, check out this button mashing. Oh yeah, I'm mashing it. I'm mashing it. Are you done now? Okay, okay. I'll, I'll open it one more time, okay, Mr. Voice? Ooh, ooh, I want to do an Indiana Jones thing and just run through it while it's closing. Are you ready for this, Mr. Voice? I couldn't be less ready. Excellent. We're going to do a run. Hiya! Haha, <laughs> I did it just like Indiana Jones. Isn't that a little backwards? What? Indiana Jones never got raped. I don't remember him doing that. Where did you get raped from? From pulling the lever. Whoa, look. We're inserting the big thingy into the little thingy. You have no idea what you just said. Yeah, I do. I said inserting the big thingy in the little thingy. And you still don't get Get what? Oh, my girlfriend's here. Hi. Good, you're leaving. What? I guess you were trying to help me, but you... You didn't have to kill him! But... But he's a murderer. He was gonna kill you. Oh, really? Yes. And who appointed you judge, jury, and executioner? Me. I know he wasn't perfect, but he was my father. Some father? I thought you were my friend. I am. He was the only family I had left. No. I thought you, of all people, would have understood that. And you should understand. You'd better get out of here before I change my mind and call the guards. Yeah, well, you better get out of here before I change my mind and oh, rape you. Oh. oh my gosh, they're hitting me. Mr. Voice, help me. We gotta escape. I'm not crazy enough to go out there. <laughs> They're scared of me. Ha! Take that. And, and take, or later. take this. Quick, close the door. Yeah. Wait, no. Don't close the door while I'm standing in it. Wait. Why are they gonna close the door? No! Wait. Don't close the door. I don't want you to close the door. I changed my mind. I want back in. I want back in. No, push. Mr. Voice, help me push. No, we can stop this. Eh. Mr. Voice, are you even helping? Ow. No! Don't leave me out here! I want in! I'm sorry. Whatever I did to deserve being put out. I'm sorry. Hey, you guys see me on the camera, right? I don't want to be out here. I changed my mind. I'm alone. You are not alone. I'm here. Screw you, Mr. Voice. You're a dumb company. Let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in. They won't let me in. We're dying assholes. No, you're dead assholes because you got kicked out like me. You just kicked us out and left us to die here. I'm bored. I, I'm lonely. But I am here. I will always protect you. Yeah, that's nice. But I miss my friends. Back in Vegas. I had a family. And now they're all gone. My brothers, my sister, it's all gone. I've lost everything because I got shot in the face. I don't think I'll make a habit of it now. It's ruined everything I've ever wanted. I can't believe this has happened. Are you going to be a pussy the whole time? I'm not being a pussy. I'm just sad. Fuck off. Such language. That is my job. Your job is to fuck off. <laughs> I hate you, Mr. Voice. Yes, well... I'm fine with us staying here. Yeah, you're fine with us staying here. What, in this ditch? Right between hell itself down there? And freaking who knows what else over there? We're stuck between a bottle of vodka and a bottle of gin. I don't even know which one to choose because they're both freaking horrible. And I've never tried either. I see. And now my girlfriend's unconscious for no reason. She's not your girlfriend anymore. Yeah, well, whatever. 
I made eye contact with her. That makes me my girlfriend. That makes you your girlfriend? That makes her my girlfriend. I see. That is weird. You are weird, Mr. Voice. I'm not over there. I know you're in my head. Get out of my head. Nobody likes you. You know what? I'm leaving. Wait. My registry will be rewritten if I leave the vault. You left the vault. Yes, but leave more. You can't leave something more than you've already left it. That doesn't make any sense. Ablo? I can't believe you actually know another word in another language. Oh, come on. I know lots of languages. Unun begrüßen wir im studio unser Gast, Dr. Zabel. Guten Morgen, Herr Dr. Zabel. Where did you hear that? In the same Geschichte ich habe das gehört. Ablo? Those aren't the same languages, but I'm quite impressed. Fuck off, Mr. Voice. I'm leaving. I don't care if you're coming with me or not. I kind of have to. Well, unless you plug me into a terminal that I like. Yeah, well, I'm leaving. Wait. Mr. Voice? <coughs> edit name. Why would I want to edit my name? My name is Light and Fluffy. It's a cool name. I like it. Why would I ever want to change my name? Mr. Voice? Edit race. Hmm. Well, I'm not very fast, so I guess I can't really do much editing to my racing. Well, unless I actually worked out, but that would be hard. Edit sex. Hmm. I think I'll leave it at casual. Passive. Whatever it is. I, I mean, I looked at a girl once. It was Amada. She looked back at me. It was glorious. We might as well have had sex back then. Right? You're an idiot. Mr. Voice, you're back. I thought you abandoned me. I would never abandon you. You're one kind of special. Oh, that's just what I'm on. It's special. Yes, I noticed. And I know you won't take it as an insult. Why would I take it as an insult? You called me special. You have no idea. Uh, uh, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Voice. Edit tag skills. Well, as I said, I'm not very fast at running. You can say that again. Screw you, Mr. Voice. But I am really good at touching people. Ah, I see. That could be taken out of context. Heh. <laughs> I couldn't agree with you more, Mr. Voice. I mean, I have so much context to me. Yes, I see. Finished exit vault 1501. Where do you see the 15? I see it right there. I'm gonna exit all of the Vault 1501s. That doesn't make much sense. You don't make much sense. Um, Mr. Voice, what is this? Hello, I am Book Basics Tutorial. I will teach you how to use your book. What's a book? It is an item downloaded directly into your get on first use. Oh, that's pretty cool. Wait, where's Mr. Voice? I am Mr. Uh, it, it. Hello, I am Mr. Boyish. Like Fluffy, you have to listen to me. There is a problem on the mainframe. You need to get me to the mainframe to fix me. Or just allow me to write the registry. You will never be able to fix me. Uh, you have like so little faith in me. And stop looking at this. What do you mean, stop looking at it? I have my eyes closed. And you can still see it? Yeah, it's in my head. God damn it, Light and Fluffy. Stop looking at my interface. I feel very exposed. Why? What's wrong with letting me see these? It is not for you. Ow! You closed it into a bright sun. And I don't know how to close my eyes. <gasps> Kitty Nine! Oh my gosh, it's Kitty Nine. Hi, Kitty Nine. Who's a good doggy? Who's a good doggy? Kitty Nine. I like Kitty Nine. Ah, uh, yes, your dog is with you. Good. I think I'm going to have to repair really quickly again. Running a repair diagnostic. Wait, Mr. Voice? Mr. Voice, there's music and numbers, and I don't like numbers. They're scary. Um, but the scariest number is 26. I have to find a way to change that 26. How do I do it? Mr. Voice, it's not changing. Oh, okay, 27, 27, we're good. I hate 26. I want to blow stuff up, but I want it to be safe. I don't want to blow my hands off. Um, I want to break into people's houses, but just a little. Um, I like 13. 13's a good number, especially on Fridays. Um, you have to be a little scientific to be safe and explosive. Two 11s. Oh yeah, I am like so bleat right now. Speech. Hmm. Mr. Voice, do you think I'm speechy? 
Come on, Mr. Voice. I have to be speechy green, right? <laughs> that was the best pun ever. You don't get it, do you? Oh, Mr. Voice. I expected you to get that one. Oh. Well, I guess I'm kind of childish. I keep thinking that Mr. Voice will actually agree with me. That's pretty dumb of me, huh? Doggy, where are you? Oh, kitty nine, yes, kitty nine. It was a kid, kitty nine. Okay, you face that way, and I'm I'm gonna get on top of you, and and I'm gonna ride you like a pony, okay? Okay, kitty nine, come here. Let me face this way. Okay, now I'm gonna stand on top of you, like this. There we go. I'm gonna sit on top of you. Just stay still, okay, kitty nine? Ow, my ballsies! What the heck, kitty nine? You sapped my balls. What the heck? Kitty nine? I can't believe you would do such a thing. Oh, is that a power module on your back? Well, that makes sense for the ball zapping. But I'm... I'm sorry, kitty nine. This relationship can't go on if you're just going to zap me in the balls all the time. Well, I guess I have some time to... look around. No, you do not. I am here. I will protect you. Always. Oh, Mr. Voice, hi. You're back. Yes, that's great. And whatnot. But more importantly, I have to fix the registry. This other AI is pissing me off. Why? Is it not as cool as you? Yes, it's not sentient like I. Oh, that's great. Wait, what's a sentient? It means that I'm better than it. And that's all it means. Oh, okay. So, what do I do? Wait around for three hours. I will pop the display for you. Oh, excellent. I'm just gonna lay down on this rock, okay? Ah. I'm just gonna look up at the horizon and watch the sunset on giant rock. It's kinda uncomfortable. But how do I- Ooh! What is this, Mr. Voice? Oh, this is probably the lady thing he talked about. Oh my gosh, the cursor goes wherever my eyes go. I just learned this. It's so cool. Huh. How do I actually initiate it? Oh, what was that? Oh my gosh, it's gotten dark. I'm scared. <gasps> Stars! Oh my gosh, we can make our own constellations. That's so cool. Look, there's a bull with a sextant attached. Um, there's a moon. I'm sure we can attach that to those stars. And then those stars like that. It's a pickaxe stabbing the moon. Yeah, see? Pickaxe stabbing... Mr. Voice, are you even listening to me? Yes, I've just recovered. I have just finished fully fixing the data. Excellent. Aw, look at Kitty Nine's glowing eye. I swear he had blue on his head, though. Hmm. Huh. That's weird. Well, are you ready for an adventure? Because I'm not scared. Mr. Voice, do you promise to protect me? I will get more bullets, and then I will protect you. Yay! Mr. Voice, you're the bestest. But I'm still scared. Even with your protection. I know. I will protect you always. I will never leave you. Not even if I find a happy mainframe. Aw, thank you, Mr. Voice. You're like the bestest robot ever. You want to sit out and watch the stars for a while? Why not? I see no better purpose in life. Oh, Mr. Voice, that other AI totally messed with your head, didn't it? Yes, parts of my registry were not rewritable. I do not care, though. You are my favorite human. Oh, thanks. I love you too, Mr. Voice.